Let's take a look at the tropics. Things are still busy out there in the Atlantic Basin. We have now Hurricane Kirk. It is the seventh hurricane of the season. A reminder that in an average season, we would have 14 named storms with seven of them becoming hurricanes. So we've met our quota and we're not done yet. In fact, we might have our next name storm then within the next 48 hours, a 90% chance that Invest 91 L out there near the coast of Africa becomes a tropical depression. It is expected to become eventually Leslie and then maybe a hurricane as well. Now, of course, I know what folks want to know about is the system back here closer to home. Well, the odds of development went from 10% to zero for the next 48 hours and have come down from 50 to 40 over the next seven days. That tells us that the National Hurricane Center and the models that everyone are looking at, it shows lower confidence in how organized the system might be. But regardless of organization, that wave is expected to get into the Gulf of Mexico, which is when it would be in a slightly more favorable environment for some organization. But timeline wise, this is Friday and it's just now getting into the western Gulf of Mexico. It is forecast to drift back toward the east through the weekend and into early next week. And that means that we will see some rising rain chances here in the Tampa Bay area. Development doesn't look super likely. We'll keep our eyes on it, though, for you here at 10 Tampa Bay.